So our physical bodies are really sensitive to their communication centers and they feel everything, all the vibrations and everything that's in our environment, everything, all the sounds, um, and everything that we expose our physical bodies to. So traveling, for me in particular, is really hard. Especially, you know, going on airplanes, staying at hotels, and because of the work that I've been doing around the planet, collaborating with other light workers, and also giving talks and seminars, um, I have to stay in hotels. And one of the things that I do, I try to remember to do it as soon as I get in, because sometimes, you know, you arrive after 20 hours flight, you're extremely exhausted, but as soon as you remember, try and do this if you're in any way um, sensitive to the hotel, if the hotel is not optimum, for example, or even just as a habit, just to clear the energies of the room that you're going to stay in. So we're going to go into the room that we're staying tonight, and um, I'll show you what to do. This is it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. So come in. So this is a above average uh, quality room. Uh, it's in Ecuador. It's what we would normally pay for a regular room in the United States. But here is it's really nice. The first thing you do is like you feel the energy. So obviously there's been thousands of people staying in this room. You have staff coming in, cleaning it. The cleaning is always really good because um, they, they move out energies and stuff. So uh, the first thing that we do would be to clear the energies, to test the energies to see if they're high, low, average. You clap, that's it. So if it feels a little bit... See how the clapping sound is changing? Uh, when it becomes really crispy there, I've cleared this little space of, of the room. So we're going to move around the room, just clapping and clearing up the energies, especially around the beds, on top of the beds. You can see here it's really, the sound is really low. So it's the beds that you're going to sleep on, clear those. I always travel with my own pillow. My physical body really loves having her pillow to sleep on, even though these pillows are really nice. She prefers her own pillow. <laughs> yes, but it's even better. So the clean is bed too. This one's a little bit heavier. I think this is the this is probably the bed that's used mostly in this room when people stay here, because this one's a little bit heavier and adjustable. So you might have to spend a bit longer cleaning that one. You can just feel the... There. That's better. We might have to work a little bit more on that later. <laughs> so we'll do the corners as well. And then the corners. There we go. Electronic equipment. Oh, this is really heavy. <laughs> You will often find that TVs and stuff, they have lots of thicker vibrations. If the person you're staying with doesn't watch television, what you can do is bring a really nice cloth or something, or even use one of the towels in the room, uh, in the bathroom, and just, you know, cover it, something like that, for the night. You can hear the difference there. So we're not going to use this one. <laughs> But we're going to put something thicker on that will cover the entire TV so we can have a really good night's sleep. Uh, sometimes a person will sleep with the TV on and then you're going to have a problem if you're sharing the room with them. Um, so next, and this is, you might have seen this in my pocket, um, this is essential oils, uh, citrus. 
uh, have a smell of the different citrus essential oils and see which one you like the best. Citrus will clear vibrational energy in the air and also, um, you know, I think, I can't remember, but I think it also uh, eliminates um, the, the, the germs and things like that. So this is the one I'm using at the moment. You obviously can make your own and bring your own little spray bottle. Um, I didn't have time to make my own or buy the little droplets to make, you know, water and mix it. So I just put it already mixed. That was on sale. <laughs> so again, you start from the, from the door and then you work your way out so you don't step into it. So this is the essential oil citrus to clean the room, corners, go there too, like that. Alright. Very good. We're going to do both beds. Chair. So also, if you're going into a location that where you can buy fresh flowers, a little, a little arrangement of fresh flowers in the room will bring some sort of light, life, and also the elemental energy that originally was with flowers and still is. And that will bring that energy of being more in nature. So if you can do that, that will also help. Okay, so we decided to carry on working with this second bed because I think because of the location where it is in the room, the windows are behind us. Um, most people sleep on this bed. So even though we've been clapping at it for quite a bit now, it's still muffled. The sound is muffled, so it's not clearing up very quickly. So one thing you can do, if you have a bell, that's actually faster to clear it up with a bell or, you know, jingle the bell or, you know, those um, uh, meditation bells. Uh, but we don't have any right now. Also, to visualize or to imagine and request uh, the energies that are left behind by individuals, to go back to them. Because when you travel somewhere, and especially if somebody is not aware, they will leave bits of themselves, of their energy behind, wherever they go. So in, in this bed, there's probably energies being left behind from individuals who, who were here before. Um, and uh, probably the cleaning stuff because that bed probably was never hasn't been made as many times this one has um, so when you clap in just visualize or, or request or you know intend send the intention of sending back to them their own energy that also helps the individual because when an individual receives back the energy that they had left behind somewhere it makes them whole complete right um, it's also a good idea, of course, if you have traveled a lot, to every now and then call back your energies and the pieces of yourself that you have left behind. So we're going to carry on doing that for this bed. As we clap on it, we're going to send back any energies and pieces of self that were left behind by those individuals who stayed here. Immediately you can feel, I don't know if you can hear it on the sound of it, but the sound is getting really crisp and clear. Even the little claps are nice and crisp and echoing around the walls. There we go. That's much better. So we, we intend for the energies to leave back to their, to their owners. So, Anyway, there'll be probably thousands of people feeling so much better right now because <laughs> they've had their energies come back to them.